All right, so I want to find the secant of the cosine, inverse cosine of one half. Cosine one, so cosine is bound between zero and pi. So what that means is, um, so one half, so um, over here, so one, two, root three. So what I end up with is root three over two. Oh, excuse me. No, that's right. So what um, root three over two, but this is equal to pi over three. So secant, and what the secant is is basically just one over cosine. So what that ends up being is one over one over two, which pretty much just ends up being equal to two. So basically you took the inverse of the cosine and then you take it time, you take one over cosine of what that is and that's how you got two. Okay, I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.